I'm Emily and welcome to Kitchenasium. Today we are making ooey gooey butter cake from Paladine. And I'm so excited because today we're going to even add some pumpkin into it to make it a pumpkin ooey gooey butter cake. And this is my favorite thing. We had it when we went to her restaurant in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. So I'm excited to be making it. So I've put the ooey cake mix in here. Which the ooey cake mix is actually going to kind of be like the crust at the bottom. And then you also have the gooey filling mix. That will be the filling that we'll add the pumpkin to. So to get started, with the box mix, it says that all together you'll need two eggs, a stick of butter, and cream cheese. You'll be making your stick of butter and you'll be cutting it in half for the cake mix and the filling mix. So I have melted it already. I'm just going to pour it in. Now I'm going to add in the one egg, and this is all for the packet that says ooey cake mix. Now that our ooey cake mix has come to a dough-like consistency, it is ready to put into a pan. And I am using my Temptations Pumpkin Patch Pie Pan. Use my hands. I want to make sure all the crust is evenly on the bottom of the pan. Oh, now I remember what I was going to say. Make sure to butter our spray your pan so nothing sticks. When you're using Temptations, you don't have to because it is non-stick. Now it's time to make the filling. I have already baked the cream cheese with a KitchenAid or stand or hand mixer, just so it's all combined. And I've decided to make a pumpkin and an original. So I'm just going to add everything in and then come back to the pumpkin once I get half of it into the pan. So we're going to add one egg, a stick of butter in our Temptations cow. This one's for you, Tegan. She loves that cow. And then add in the ooey gooey filling mix, which I don't have a scissor for. I got my scissor and then I put all my mix into the kitchen egg and just look how smooth it came out. So I'm going to be doing half of it original and half of it pumpkin. I have put in half of the filling into the pie pan and I have half of the filling left in our bowl. And now I'm going to make it pumpkin just by adding some pumpkin puree. This is just some canned pumpkin. I'm just going to add in about one big spoonful. Maybe two. So now that I have finished mixing the pumpkin puree into our filling, I'm just going to pour it in. Now it's time to bake this delicious ooey gooey butter cake, pumpkin and original. So you're going to cook this on 350 for 30 to 40 minutes. And you want to make sure that the inside, when you poke a toothpick in it, it's still gooey because this is a gooey butter cake. So I'm going to go put this into the oven. Our ooey gooey butter cake has come out of the oven and it looks so good. I cannot wait to try this when my guests arrive. I'm so excited. You can clearly see how what is pumpkin and what is regular. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Kitchen Asian while making ooey gooey butter cake mix from Paula Dean. Thank you so much for watching. Watch other videos. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, and subscribe, like, and comment down below. See you next time. Bye! Can we get you ooey gooey now? Butter cake? The box mix? Yes. Okay. I can't wait to make these. I want to try them with the pumpkin, too, because those ones we had upstairs in the restaurant. You want to get two boxes? Okay. Bake on the pumpkin. And one original, because the originals are really good.